Destiny. Destiny. Why are you doing this to me, man? Why are you doing this to me? You're taking away my loot crates. My, 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 my caves, man. You're taking away the only dominant strategy that I can have fun with. And see like 20 people just stand there and shoot at the same shit. Why? Don't patch this, man. See? You see, this is, this, this is IGN's fault. This is IGN's fault, and then they want to play safeguard. They report this shit, and then they want to act all surprised when Destiny patched this shit up. They report it, and they know they're popular too. So every time they put up a post on Destiny, you see a whole bunch of comments go, Oh, why the fuck is IGN reporting this? Stop doing it, Destiny's gonna patch it. Yes! Yes! Why are you doing this to us? Give me back my loot cave, man. I mean, I, I seen a couple players just stand there expecting the, the, the respawns to happen, expecting the, the bad guys to be there, the vandals or whatever, and they're just standing there all alone just waiting. And I'm like, have you guys heard the news? They patched it! You can't do it anymore! Well, not in that location. Apparently, there's a new location now, and IGN's fucking that shit up too. So, whatever god you was praying to to keep that shit a secret, uh, that shit is done. So, fuck that. That shit is over. But you know what? Dominant strategy, me being a game designer, takes away the fun out of things. You know? If it's taken too far, like low kicks in a fighting game, or grabs in a fighting game, or hitting somebody against a wall in a fighting game. Dominant strategies exist everywhere. That's why I like Dead or Alive, you know? Some of the boards in Dead or Alive, there's not, not really that many walls. Um, it, well, there, there are, but most of them, like the ringside in uh, Dead or Alive 4, the electric wall, bounces you off and gives you damage, but it, at, at least it gets you off the wall, though, you know? Dominant strategy is a thing that people use as a safe blanket, as like a security blanket, you know, when they're losing, when they're panicking, uh, when they feel, actually when they're panicking and when they feel empowered, so it, 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 it goes on the both sides of the spectrum. You know, if I'm whooping your ass and I have you against the wall, or you know, if I find something that makes me, you know, secured and happy, oh, I found some loot over here, or I'm beating you up against the wall, or my low kicks is taking mad damage because you're not fucking blocking at all, you know, I'm gonna continue with that. And that's the effects of dominant strategy, but taking it too far can ruin the game. So, you know what? Patching. That loot cave may be a solution. Maybe something, you know, good for the game. Uh, a lot of people are tired of playing multiplayer, you know, even though they leveled out all the weapons, people still have those tidbits and status changes and, uh, you know, uh, little things on their weapons that can still give them a, the advantage. And where do they get that from, you know? Where do most players get that? Uh, advantage from, you know? I mean, a lot of players did it the, the, the normal way, the hard way. Grinding, going on strikes, and everything like that. But, most of the time, and a lot of the time in gaming, people go with dominant strategy. Something that's always there, something that breaks the system, something that makes you feel empowered, and rewards you at the end. So, you know what? I'm kind of indifferent about this whole loot cave scenario. Go ahead, patch it up. So what's the point of this video? Well, dominant strategy is good until somebody overuses it. You know, game design can be destroyed. The fun out of games can be sucked out by just one common practice. So be careful, especially when making games and playing. Because if you take advantage of something and depend on it, it'll just go away. And you depending on that, well, you take that for granted. And then you're going to have to do things the hard way or the normal way for most people. So, 
Just remember that, guys. Okay? Alright. Well, that's it for today's video, but if you want to see more, go ahead and click on my main channel, Alter Element Games. There, I have videos ranging from gameplay highlights, full video game reviews, music soundtracks from some of the best games, and gaming and news updates. Keep it live here at Alter Element Games, and visit my fan page on Facebook and Twitter. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you for supporting my channel. Cafe LA, peace and love, I'm out of here. Yeah, yeah.